There's little Percy. He's got back and neck problems and hasn't been able to walk very well for the last few days. So we're trying to help him by doing some acupuncture. And what that involves is putting really fine little needles into his neck and into his back as well. We're going to leave them in for about 10 or 15 minutes. It's only his second ever session and you can see he's tolerating it pretty well. He's getting a little bit sleepy too, aren't you Percy? And what the acupuncture will do is it'll make him feel better. It produces endorphins which makes him feel happy. And even though it's only his second session, it's already helping. He's already able to use his legs a lot better and he's become a lot more, a lot more comfortable. And, uh, with cats, sometimes they'll tolerate so much and then if you overdo it, they'll go nuts. So you've got to be really quite careful. So I'm using much finer needles this time. It's okay, sweet. If you just rub them for me, yeah, yeah, just gently rub them. And if you do too much, they'll turn around and bite you. Hmm. You've got to be careful. Yeah, he really bites. They all will. <laughs> My other cats that I'm doing are much more inclined to inclined to bite. If you just rub them under the chin, okay, yeah. it's okay, it's okay. okay. Are you too sore? Yeah, you don't want to be famous. Mm, okay, I'm going to take this. He's a little bit sore on that side. It's not like a person, you can lie them down and say, right, this is what we're going to do to you, and stick 20 needles in, you lie there and grit your teeth. That doesn't work with cats. You've just got to work with them. And, and um, he's sore, he's still, he's still quite sore, so that's, that's why he's not, he's not that happy about it. The amount he's in at the moment, that, that's all he's happy to tolerate today, so that's all we're going to do today. Might maybe get a little bit more done the next time, but um, I'm not going to push him. You just rub him for me again, do yeah. you? Know? So just gently oh, rub him. I'm just going to pop these out. Okay, there we go. He shouldn't feel that coming out. He is all done. So wow. I'm just going to show you how to massage him because he is quite—he's been quite sensitive. Okay. So um, if you stick out your arm, I'll show you on you. Okay. So you just like that. Okay. okay. So you don't you don't put your fingers in like that. Yeah. So you just rub them and then when you come to here, this part here yeah. is the spine. Okay. So you can see he's he's, he's, he's just like this. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And then you increase the pressure according to what he'll what he'll what he'll yeah. tolerate. Like today he's not tolerating much at all. Okay. Um, so but maybe tomorrow morning he might, he might be might, better. Yeah. See, even yeah. the light is touched, I can see he's unhappy about that. He's, he's flinching, he's still very sore. Yeah. He's still very sore, so it's just going to take some time.